Hi everyone and welcome. In the previous video, we have covered that how you can read holding registered data of your Moodbase serial or to your RS485 device in the LabVIEW GUI. Now, in this video, instead of holding registered data, we are going to read the input registered data in the LabVIEW GUI. So here, I am again using open MoodSim software to simulate Moodbase serial device. And my Moodbase serial device is running on the COM1 with 9600 baud rate, data bits 8, parity none, and the stop bit 1. And here you can see the Moodbase point type is input register. And we are going to read this input register data in the LabVIEW GUI. So here is my LabVIEW GUI. Okay. So first of all, we have to specify COM port on which COM port we are going to read the data. Okay. On which COM port our Moodbase serial device is connected so my modbus serial device or simulated device is connected on the com1 but internally it is also connected to com2 so i'm going to use com2 here and unit id is one the parity is none as you can see here the baud rate is 9600 starting address is zero and we are going to read six input register okay so all i have to do is i have to run this vi and you can see it is reading the data if i want to simulate another input register then also i can do that i just have to double click here i have to click on the auto simulation i have to enable i have to specify the high limit and then okay you can see it's simulating and it's reading the data so this is how you can use LabVIEW to read input register data of any of your Morbus Serial RTU or RS485 device. You can also combine this project with the holding register project and you can uh, read holding register data along with input register data in single project from single device or multiple device. Okay, so that's possible with the LabVIEW. So I hope this thing is clear that with the help of LabVIEW, you can create a GUI of your data. You can also read data from your Moodbus serial device and you can display uh, that data value on the GUI. You can also use some different format to display the data like gauge or slider, anything in the LabVIEW. But this is just an example. So that's why I have used this simple uh, data display format. Okay, and if you want to buy this LabVIEW project, then link will be available in the description. You can go there and you can buy this LabVIEW project and if you have any question or any doubt in this lab view project then you can always ping me on telegram instagram whatsapp also you can comment on this video also you can send me a mail now in the next video instead of input registered data reading we are going to read the call status of modbus serial device okay so let's meet in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you